Buffalo's theater district has been very quiet for the past 15 months, but now it's about to spring back to life. As our man Mike Randall shows us tonight, we have a sneak peek. It's all new at six. Leave it to the new guy to bring live theater back to the city. We're the first one in the theater district. Theater is back in the theater district. Chris Hanley took over at the Alleyway Theater just as everything shut down. We're so excited. It's been a long, long year and a half, and it's awesome to be back. It's awesome to be doing plays again in person. Chris is launching the Buffalo Quickies, the crowd-pleasing short play festival that is a Buffalo tradition. Buffalo Quickies has been around for 30 years at the alleyway, and uh, it's a smorgasbord of different plays every 10 minutes. The clever staging puts each play in a separate location. No, don't put me on hold. I need to speak with... Most of the plays are in window fronts right on Main Street in the theater district. The short story is we're doing six different full productions. We have to put on six plays. So each play needs its own uh, lighting and sets and sound. Each of the six plays will make that five plays in one musical has its own playwright, cast, and director. Josie DiVincenzo is one of those directors. It's such a collaborative, wonderful thing to be a part of. We're just giddy right now. It is so energizing. Everyone's in such a great mood because we're doing what we love. Each venue is set for a small, intimate crowd, and the audience moves from play to play. Think of it, live actors doing live theater right here on Main Street in downtown Buffalo. The only catch is you have to wear a pair of these to hear what's going on. This dress rehearsal crowd figured out those headsets, no problem. You don't see me asking why. You don't see me complaining. The show officially opens Thursday. Tickets must be purchased in advance on the theater's website at alleyway.com. Which means you'll see all the hits from our previous episodes. Is Buffalo ready for some live theater in a fun, never attempted before setting? You bet they are. Buffalonians are such amazing group of people because they love this new stuff that's happening. Everyone gets so energized. In Buffalo, Mike Randall, 7. Eyewitness News.